Yo guys, it's Vast here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Razer Naga 2014 Professional MMO Gaming Mouse. Now this is a, obviously a gaming mouse, uh, and it has uh, it's packed full of features. So for starters, as you guys can see, we've got the green LEDs. Now these are customizable, any colour if you get the chroma option. Uh, however, if you just get the normal standard version, you can change this um, to off. You can basically switch them on and off. You've got the pulse seating logo at the back, the scroll wheel which features tilt, um, tilt click, which is a tilt click and scroll thumb wheel, uh, and lit up on the sides, as well as the 12 mechanical thumb grid on the left hand side here. Um, in terms of aesthetics, it looks really, really nice in my opinion. Um, so yeah, that's basically the top covered. Uh, it's very nice, it's got, uh, you can use it in a claw type grip if you want, or you can just use the stand in like this. Uh, it's very comfy like this, it has actually got like a finger rest sort of thing that I'm sorry if you guys can't see by the way. Let's hit the should help a little bit. Right, so uh, yeah, obviously you've got the little thing here, it's just because it's black and it's quite hard to see because my room's quite dark. Um, we've got a 1.2 metre braided, no, 1 point, yeah, one, no, 1 1.5 metre braided cable here, but it makes it very, very hard to tangle. Um, and it's also quite stiff, but however, it does look really, really nice and complements it very well, as well as being very, very rugged and durable. Taking a look on the bottom, you've got your serial number, um, your model number, your product number, um, your power rating, so that's all over there, and uh, obviously you've got the barcode, whatever. And here you've got uh, your optical sensors, this, this is what it's going to be to do this. It's an invisible laser sensor, uh, which is nice. Um, on the front, you can actually get it around. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there are two vents there and there. It's quite hard to see even in real life, but there are two vents, and they are basically vents because it gets hot quite. It can get quite hot. Obviously, it's a gaming mouse. It's very, um, very. Um, I don't know what to say. Um, like pop standard. So obviously, you're using a lot of power for that. Um, but yeah. Uh, if you use Razer, Synapse, Game Configurator, you can actually change all of these to macro keys, which is very, very nice indeed. Uh, it definitely does help. It's amazing for MMO games uh, because obviously you've got all your macros there. Um, but yeah, it's big. I use this for productivity as well as um, gaming. So I would use this for like everything from Sony Vegas to Photoshop to uh, like Far Cry, GTA, stuff like that. There you go, guys. The vents there in the front. That's what I was trying to show you earlier. You get the wireless version, you will not have the wire here, instead you'll have a little charging port there, uh, which is nice. I probably will upgrade to the wireless version sometime soon, probably wireless chroma as well, fit my colour scheme better. Um, but yeah, this is definitely my favourite mouse I've ever used. The death ad is very nice as well, if I do end up getting that, I'll probably do a video on it. Uh, yeah, um, it's made out of plastic, it's all plastic. Um, obviously you've got your mechanical switches here, very clicky. Mouse is quite clicky. Uh, these do actually have springs underneath them, and they will get more worn in the more you use it. So for me, I usually have it like this. So I generally really use the top. However, if you use the bottom, you will feel uh, after, over time you definitely feel the significance there of how much it will change. Um, because I've actually my cousin's got this and my other cousin's got it as well. So clicky again. You've got scroll to tilt to the left, tilt to the right, and click in. So all in all, we've got twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, uh, 18, wait, 12, so 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20 buttons all in all. This has to be one of the most um, buttoned, I would say, most I have ever seen uh, on the market. But yeah, that's pretty much it then, guys. Um, US and UK links down below tomorrow. Um, but yeah, thank you all so much for watching. I uh, hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, then make sure to drop a like down below to um, let me know. It does definitely help out a lot. I love getting a like and especially feedback as well. So leave some feedback in the comments. Um, if you did not like the video, then you know what to do. Um, but if you did, then also uh, a subscribe will be appreciated as well. It's the 10th video in a row today, which I'm quite happy with. Um, very consistent I would say to be honest uh, 10 videos in a row since we started the channel uh, so that's pretty good 
but yeah, that's pretty much it then, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Have a nice day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.